It's the Tony Wolf Show. Hello, everybody. It's your boy, Tony. Um, just some th random thoughts. Forgive the big mess behind me. And here's my glasses. I just took them off because I was getting a really bad glare with the way I've got my lights set up. Um, this video is going to be a little different. Um, a lot of people have, over the years, have thought, Tony, why aren't you doing graphic design or video work or post-production or photography for a living? And the basic answer is, there's not enough paid jobs in the MOV to do it. I said, I mean, I would love to be doing it full time. Actually, I've applied for jobs that are full time. And I may know Adobe CS5, but Creative Cloud I have used before. I had it as a um, sample for a month. And the only reason I don't have it now is because I don't have a need for it. I'm not going to pay for something on a monthly subscription if I don't use it daily. Once you learn Photoshop, Premiere Pro, Audition, After Effects, once you learn those on one version, it's basically just learning the where is everything, how have they changed it, how, I'm trying to think, what's the best way to assemble your product, put your parts together. And for anybody who's ever looked at my work, I mean, I've had DVDs put out on the market. I've done sizzle reels for reality shows. I've done high school graduations. I've done birthdays. I've done... PSAs when I was in college, I have an eye and a really good knack for graphic design, video work, and post-production, stuff like that. It's just I've never been given the opportunity. I've tried to make opportunities for myself, and it never worked out. I had one place, which I will not name, that they literally, I interviewed for them right after I got my associate's degree. And they basically told me they wanted somebody. Excuse me. They told me they wanted somebody who could be available seven days a week, 12 hours or more a day. And basically have no life outside of this company. And be able to travel the entire state of West Virginia. That wasn't for me. I had just got done with the wrestling, my wrestling career as a referee, and I was really not wanting to do a lot of travel. Now, I'm willing to relocate, but it's only to certain places. Places that I've looked at are Wilmington, North Carolina, because I love the beach. I may not swim and play in the ocean and all that stuff, but I love the beach. I love the sounds. I love the smells. I just love the paradise that it brings to my heart, and it brings a soft spot to my heart. Um, I've looked at Jacksonville, Florida. Um, I've looked at a few other places along the East Coast, but if I'm going to go somewhere, it's going to be somewhere where I can get opportunities. I've got people that I went to college with that went west and have had great opportunities in California. But being a only child, I'm just not real big on getting that far away from my family. Anybody that knows me knows that I am a family person. I may be single, but I am there when mom and dad and my aunt when they need somebody, I'm there. But this video is a little bit about me 
a little bit about why I haven't done video work on the big time or done graphic design or any of that stuff. If you look at my work, everybody that I've talked to has been real impressed with my work. It's just getting that one opportunity. So I'm hoping between this video, the applications that I've been putting in, even with my age, I've got a look for I can do retro, I can do more today's thoughts on design, but I also know how to look at something and I can tell you how to shoot. Like I'm shooting this in my bedroom with my tablet and it's the first time I've used my new tablet as a video production device. So I'm going to end this video. I'm going to send it to my Google Dive or Drive, whatever it's called. That way I can edit it on my desktop and then post it on social media. Um, anybody that's out there that wants to look at my stuff, you can go to YouTube and look at Tony Wolf, W-O-L-F-E, so it's Tony Wolf's blog, and I've got stuff on there for almost 12 years. Now, I took some of the really bad stuff when I was first getting started off, but there's some really good stuff on there, shows some animation work that I've done, shows editing over my career, and um, you can go to my website which I'll put a link to that at the bottom. And uh, you can look at some of my graphic design, some of my photography work. And uh, I just want one a chance. I just want somebody to take that leap of faith on this old man and somebody who's willing to really say, mm. maybe he's got what it takes. Give him a shot. So thank you. And uh, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Click, click subscribe. You'll see all my social media links on here. And um, y'all have a good day.